Hey everyone, uh, welcome back. Warlock Sanctum Games. We're doing an interview series and we're going to start with Seaval. Uh, Seaval is one of the paid GMs on the Discord. But uh, why don't you introduce yourself? Hey there, everybody. Seaval here. Um, long time role player, long time ST GM, all that stuff. Started with LARPing and decided to transition into tabletops. All right. So, Zeval, how long have you been doing the paid GMing thing? Um, start playing games started about two years ago. So, when I heard about them, I latched on there. All right. And overall, what would you say your two biggest strengths in running games are? Uh, two biggest strengths is being highly adaptable. And because I usually run in World of Darkness, I know the lore really well. So, just getting into the lore of the world, and then how things work with that lore. And not being beholden to the almighty lore. <laughs> Fair. The meta can be crushing sometimes. Um, well, with that said, that probably goes into our next question. Two favorite systems to run. If you, if you had two to run right now, what would it be? Masquerade is near and dear to my heart. I've been reading it since age five and pretty much first publication um i actually got that from my aunt and that's number one no matter what um number two again world of darkness except for this time chronicles of darkness i just it it's been my D. &D. fair fair if we can refine those because I don't know if our audience knows, but uh, World and Chronicle of Darkness are broken down to all different types of supernatural creatures. From World of Darkness, what's your favorite line? Masquerade, 100%. Um, I do tend to prefer my Sabbat. However, I do not like the murder hobo Sabbat. I always go orthodoxy. All right. All right. And same questions for the Chronicles of Darkness. That one I would either have to go through Werewolf the Forsaken because of pack dynamics, it's a lot easier, or just the insanity that is mage. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, with that said, I've had a chance to talk to some of your players, uh, or at least browse and watch from a distance because, you know, I can see everything on Discord. You run with at a virtual tabletop usually. How does that go? Um, I usually do Google Images because I try and keep it relatively modern day. So I just pop up Seattle. I'm still learning all the hidey holes and everything. It's my new home city, even though Atlanta will always be where my heart is. <laughs> nice. Yeah, you can tell by the World of Darkness love. Um, <laughs> but just pull that up, allow people to see it, and just go through descriptions through the slight alterations because world of darkness chronicles of darkness it's our world but darker <laughs> fair enough all right and so i'm sure you've always got ideas bouncing through your heads but if you had to run a game in an hour it needed to be a setup for a new campaign and the group wanted something different what plot would you throw at them i would actually probably try and run monster of the week or worldwide wrestling because they're super easy to pick up super streamlined and i can pick that up and run with it uh worldwide wrestling hey you're wrestlers let's see where your career goes monster of the week hey let me just turn on uh, supernatural get some plot lines there All right, any plot hooks that come to mind to grab people, like if you were starting in an hour? Um, Very much I go with the kidnapping angle because, hey, someone's gone missing. It, always a good mystery. Um, I usually try and pick uh, someone from the character's backgrounds or something like that because one of my philosophies is you put the knife in your back, I just twist it. <laughs> so... <laughs> It's bad luck. I like that. <laughs> I like that. All right. Uh, so I'm out of my main questions, but Seaval, do you have any public games you wanted to shout out before this video goes live? Um, 
on the line of mage i do have mage the ascension unfortunately i am affected by an entropy mage my players seem to be on mismatching schedules half the time oh no join- when, when does that run uh that is thursday 2 to 4 p.m pacific time all right all right uh anything else you want to tell the audience before we close up nothing i can really think of <laughs> all right guys uh that's been c val i'm matthew and i'm hoping to do a lot more of these interviews with the different paid gms out there i hope this was helpful and i'll leave a link to c val's profile in the comments everyone have a good day and we will see you again another time be safe out there <laughs>